right now, but you're more than welcome to come on out. They got plenty of uh, vendors uh, who are showing off uh, their wares. Uh, you can learn a little bit more about Bigfoot. But uh, also joining us, he performed, uh, well, I think he kind of opened the show this morning, uh, uh, Mike DeRome. Good morning, Mike. Good morning, Kevin. How you doing? I'm doing well. And yourself? Good. I did open the show. Yeah. I was just going to say, uh, you know, of course, you, you are a, a firm Bigfoot believer, are you not? Oh, most definitely. So, all most right. definitely. Very good. So, so tell us how you opened the show this morning and, uh, and your role in the uh, the event today. Apparently, uh, some children entered a contest and they wrote lyrics to a song about the Bigfoot man. Okay. Yeah, there was a contest all summer long for that. And right? apparently the winner couldn't make it, oh. but they asked me to perform the song for them. So me and Michael Hoff did. Okay. And we did apparently a really good job. All right. And we're Bigfoot fans now forever. No. Uh, obviously, vocal singer uh, from uh, was it Mikado? Mikado. Okay. Yeah. All right. And so they asked you to come on in and sing the song. What did you think of the song? It was quite challenging. Was it? It, it, it was good, <laughs> but it was a parody on Home on the Ring, so we all know that song. Then it gave it that campfire sound. The Zimbabwe drummer played his drum, and that gave it a little, a little right. taste of exoticness. But it went real, real well. All right. So uh, outside of uh, performing a Bigfoot song, uh, you're best known for. Uh, tell us a little bit about your music. My name is Potato Mike. I've been playing in the area for over 20 years, and most of the venues that are available out there uh, over time. And I play classic rock, classic country, Motown, a little bit of everything. You gotta have a good repertoire up here. Sure. Because there's so many diverse people in the area. Well, now, now do, you, uh, do you have the okay to do that Bigfoot song anytime you like to when you're out performing? Apparently so, because I did it last night. I did it last night. We just did a gig at Shotmaker. Oh, did you? And we practiced it there. And that crowd loved it, so we knew it would work today. Oh, there you go. Well, if you, if you missed out, I'm sure you'll put it on an upcoming uh, CD. It'll be on uh, one of your tracks. Right? Something like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It'll be fun for years to come. Uh, yeah, if we could have been here early enough, we could have heard you sing it. Now, you've, you've deferred from singing the song for us here, but uh, they're just going to have to find or come here. You where are you performing next? Uh, next will be at Shotmakers again, the okay. 13th of October. All right. Uh, so if we'll, come on out and see you, will you perform the Bigfoot we song? We sure will. There we'll definitely go. do it. All right. Now, I, I jokingly said at the beginning about you being a believer. Have, have you ever had an experience? Are you, uh, you know? I did have an experience. While traveling the mighty off Salvo River one day, oh. a storm came up. I tipped over, a big hand grabbed me up out of the water, <laughs> threw me on shore, and I've been a believer ever since. Uh, you know what? You need to go talk to Jeff, Jeff Hansen. Uh, uh, he'd love to hear that story. <laughs> I bet he would. All right. Uh, well, Mike, it's been a pleasure, and uh, well, congratulations for being uh, picked to, uh, to, to perform the uh, the Bigfoot song, and congratulations. They didn't give me who the winner was, but uh, the, uh, the, the uh, girl uh, did a great job of an uh, 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 alternate Stop version scale. of Home on the Range, Bigfoot style. Right. Well, thank you very much for You're having welcome. me here. I appreciate it. Yeah, appreciate Y'all have a good time. day and good night, Oscar. There you go. Bash. I love that. Bigfoot Bash, it's going on all the way.